Thanks, Riven. Yes, top lane and jungle. And here I am with the top laner, Zion Spartan, right here. Second game in a row you picked Nidalee, this time in victory. What changed about this game that didn't happen yesterday for you? Uh, I think we had a change in mindset. We realized, hey, if you get Nidalee ahead, she's going to do a lot of work in the game. And me and Crumbs worked really well together that game. Just like, we we're literally just like laning 2v1 versus Inox. It's like, it's really brutal because he's a melee champion. You're up there with the ranged and a new new. You just power down the turret, and that's kind of what we did that game. And you guys were able to break a five-game losing streak here. What's the team morale looking like since you have been losing so much heading towards the last few weeks of the year? Um, I think that uh, the morale was a little poor, but, you know, it, we don't really let that get to us. We focus on every game individually, and getting this win is definitely going to help us out. Teams, everyone's been saying, oh, Dignitas, they're just going to lose like they do every split at the end of the split. They're just going to fall down. But I want to say no. We're going to be a new team Dignitas. We're going to be a different team Dignitas than the Dignitas you've everyone's seen before. And I think that we have a lot, long ways to go, but I think we can do it this split. I mean, how do you get there then? Because you just won the first game and you have two weeks left. What's on the, just in the forecast for next week of practice? Um, I think we, lately, like starting a couple weeks ago, we started looking at all our games, whether it was wins or losses, and focusing on every mistake we could. And we just got to make like the big, big decisions. We need to make the right choices. And that's what kind of has been losing us games. Like yesterday in our game, we completely missed the dragon timer and they just got a free dragon because of that. Little mistakes like that, we can't let that happen. And big, like, like impacting game-throwing de decisions, we need to just be better with those. And if we can do that, I think we'll be a really good team. We're going to send it to the guys at the analyst desk really shortly here, but final question, what do you think, aside from the Nidalee, was the biggest uh, factor in your victory here? I just think we were communicating really well, and we knew what we had to do to win the game. And we knew that before we came into the game, we knew that during the game, and we executed the plan perfectly. So I think that's what we just have to keep doing. All right, execution, and congratulations on your victory and snapping the losing streak, Zion. For now, though, let's send it over to Dash 